Hi everyone, it's Alina from Exclamate Mastery here. And just like last week with the labor report setup, I can run labor only reports. This week I want to show you how you can export your estimate line items from Xactimate to Excel. So if you need to give only a paint sub, just these line items. If you want to show a homeowner just we're doing this part of the estimate. Whatever you want to do with it, it's a little bit easier to manipulate in Excel and then maybe create your own invoice template than have to try to manipulate it in Xactimate with their specialized reports and things. So sometimes exporting to Excel is your quickest and easiest way to be able to manipulate what you need to do in the program. So let's go take a look at how to export your estimate to an Excel spreadsheet. In order to export the estimate into Excel, you do need to be in the estimate itself. So we can't be here in the Control Center dashboard. We do need to go ahead and open up an estimate. And then you're going to navigate to the blue Project tab in the top left corner. Not many people know about the Project tab, but it is there and contains quite a few cool things, actually. And one of them is the Export to Excel. So when you click on the blue Project tab, navigate down to Tools and then left click on send to Excel. And that's what's going to generate that Excel spreadsheet. So I'm gonna left click on that hyperlink there. It's actually going to open up Excel. It's not gonna ask you to save as or anything like that. This is the desktop version and that's the way it's working here. Online version may be a little bit different. This will open up an Excel spreadsheet for us. And as you can see, the spreadsheet is grouped by room or roof. So that's how it's organizing the estimate. And then you've got your quantity, your unit cost, sales tax, RCV, all of that fun stuff. And we can delete off any columns we don't want here, uh, delete off whatever line items we didn't need if we were just giving it to a certain sub, or maybe you're only bidding part of the job with the homeowner. You, you just want them to see a certain section, whatever the case may be here. This is one of the best ways to do it. It's kind of hard to use the work order in Xactimate or some of those other edited reports. This is the quickest and easy way to really get the information out with the pricing, and then you can manipulate it here in the spreadsheet. This also can be imported to some of the CRMs that y'all use, so if that's something that you want to do, it is a step between Xactimate and the CRM, but it easily gets the information out, and therefore you can import it, change it, do whatever you'd like. So my name is Alina Wilson with XM8 Mastery. If you like the topic, please like and share the video. If you're interested in getting our weekly tips, go ahead and subscribe to his channel. If you'd like more info on XM8 Mastery and what we do, go ahead and go to www.xm8mastery.com. I'll see you next week.